Uh, it's Tom here at Cladding Mate and for Cladding Services. Just a quick one today to chat to you exactly what is a nibbler and what is it used for? So on the screen now you'll see a nibbler and this is one of Trump's nibblers. This is the N160 nibbler and that's capable of cutting 1.6 mil thick mild steel and a nibbler cuts metal sheets by punching holes out of the sheet. So once you've cut a sheet with a nibbler you end up with two pieces of metal, uh, a line that's been taken out of the sheet of metal and a load of little filings and chips and that's what the nibbler has punched out of the piece of metal and because the nibbler works the way it does it doesn't work like a like scissors or a set of shears where it literally just slices down in a line so when you're using a nibbler you need to be careful you know that it's just going to take a chunk out of your sheet because of the way nibblers work, it can be slow to actually cut sheets of metal. So if you've got long sheets of metal where you're cutting straight lines, a nibbler is probably not the tool for you. You should use a set of shears or slitting shears for that. But for a nibbler, because of the design of it, it is very nimble. It's perfect for doing fine details and doing curved cuts and intricate designs. Um, so if you're doing offcuts or flashings or anything like that and it's small little chunks just to make sure it fits in place then a nibbler is what you want. So on the screen you can see uh, the design of a nibbler. So a nibbler consists of the body of the machine, the battery, but also then what you call the head of the machine. And the head is made up of a punch, a die and a punch carrier mainly. So what happens is the punch is the piece uh, that actually moves on the nibbler and that moves up and down and basically chomps away at the metal. You've got a die that's underneath and that punch goes up and down into that die and it's this mechanism here, which looks a bit dodgy, that actually cuts your piece of metal out. And then you've got a punch carrier and the carrier just make sure that that punch stays lined and in place as it's moving up and down at fast speeds. Just with anything that's uh, moving, it wears. So over time, your punch and your die will wear out. Realistically, it's the punch that's doing most of the work, which means that a punch wears out twice as fast as your die. Luckily, Trump do sell these punches and dies in kits. So you can get a cost-effective um, pack, which includes two punches and one die. 